Hey there and welcome to Japan Online. While the drums are drumming, the bugles are playing, the food is being cooked, the rope has been untangled, the kites are being fixed, the police have shown up, the Instagram video has been taken, it can only mean one thing, it's the Hamamatsu Kite Festival. Hamamatsu Festival ha is held every May 3rd to the 5th, so three days uh, over, gold, over Golden Weekend uh, here in Japan. Um, it's the cel it, well, it originally was to celebrate the firstborn son um, of, a, of the prince um, about four or five hundred years ago in Hamamatsu, um, and is now sort of uh, celebrates the firstborn child, whether it be boy, boy or girl. Um, and of course, we have this big festival for celebrating kids. Back. Basically, um, and if you can, you won't be able to see here, but uh, the the child's name will be on usually about the bottom right in a big yellow, uh, like um, oval shape, um, with the child's name here. Here we have um, a family celebration that. <laughs> Here we have the mother and father, family and close friends celebrating their firstborn child uh, in this uh, district. In the back there, the quite there, will have a yellow mark on the right there with the, the child's name. Um, and the family pays uh, to have, get the kites made. There may be three of them, so it's quite expensive. They also supply, supply uh, alcohol, food, money to that uh, district, that suburb there, um, for while they're at this festival over the three days. So it can be quite expensive. Um, but that is only part of the Hamamatsu festival. The second part is the kite battles, which we're sort of going to have a look now. So part of the fun is to get your kite up in the air and as you can see there's probably a good uh, 20 kites there. Um, some days there could be you know 30, or 30 to 50 kites um, and once they're up it's the kite battle. Um, and as you can see there's the, all the strings are coming together um, and the there's no real um, explanation of why this happens, it just happens. But the kites come together and all these people are chanting and yelling at each other to, to battle to bring down uh, the other uh, districts kites and they do this by uh, coming close to uh, like a wire or something like this and getting their kite strings tangled up and then wearing down the rope so that the kites break. <laughs> sounds very confusing and chaotic um, but these guys do it every year maybe uh, five or six times uh, over the three days they just they've got like uh, three or four or five kites to each district and uh, they put them up and they let them fly and then to bring them down they may bring them down normally but a lot of the time they get into these battles um, and they can go for like an hour where they're just struggling and like this and pulling each other's strings sometimes they'll go to the building that's in the background there and show um, uh, the uh, mayor of the city uh, the, the sponsors of the city that this is the battle and then they'll come back over here and they just keep tugging war uh, to and fro until their kite strings break and this happens uh, kites come usually crashing down 
and get uh, d damage. This is why they bring, you know, um, three or four kites to the actual event. So, if you're coming to Hamamatsu in uh, Shizuoka Prefecture, come around Golden Week, May the 3rd to the 5th, and um, experience this lovely event. Anyway, thanks for watching. I'm Ashley. I um, hope you enjoyed this video. There's a couple of videos that you might be interested. Uh, check those out. If you haven't subscribed, click on the subscribe button, the bell button, and as usual, keep an eye out for more videos coming soon. Later.